In this video, I'm pushing the boundaries of what's possible with AI technology by attempting to create a faceless YouTube channel only using AI. I'm gonna try and use AI technology for everything from the idea and script right through to the video creation. I'm really excited about this. I think it's gonna be a fun experiment. Plus, I'm gonna get the chance to show you some awesome AI tools that you do not wanna miss. Wait a minute, I've just recorded that intro and I'm sorry, I think it was out. Should I really be doing a video about this? We're all scared of AI taking over our jobs and one of my jobs is YouTube and now I'm creating a video showing people how to do my job with AI. I'm probably shooting myself in the foot here, but if AI takes over and my YouTube career is over, it's my own fault. But before it does, make sure you hit the subscribe button because I'm gonna be dropping some epic content over the next few weeks and you do not wanna miss it. Anyway, back to the video. YouTube automation is big business and there's guys making millions with faceless YouTube channels. But these YouTube channels usually require you to pay people to write scripts, record voiceovers, edit the videos, and it can be really time consuming and an expensive process. Well, that was until AI changed the game. And in this video, I'm gonna put it to the test. The first tool that I'm going to use is this one here called vidIQ, which is a YouTube growth tool that I've actually been using for quite a while on my channel. It helps me find keywords and, and come up with title ideas, and it's got quite a lot of cool tools inside of this, but they've recently just introduced some epic AI technology, which is off the scale, and I'm going to use that technology to create this YouTube channel. They actually have a few AI tools, which we are going to play around with, but the one I'm most excited about is this one here called AI Coach, which is very similar to ChatGPT, which which I'm sure you've heard of, the chatbot, which you can ask almost anything. Well, this AI coach is like ChatGPT. It's actually based on the same technology, but it's a lot more specific about YouTube growth because they've actually fed it a lot of additional information about YouTube and how to grow on YouTube and all of the information that you need to grow a YouTube channel that ChatGPT doesn't know. So this is actually better than ChatGPT for asking YouTube orientated questions. It can do anything from help you with YouTube title ideas, write YouTube scripts it can it can do some crazy stuff and we're going to be using it in this video if you want to try this out yourself i've actually spoken to vidiq and managed to get a 98 percent discount if you want to try this out you get access to all of the tools including this ai coach and you can use my link in the description down below to get access to that but what i'm going to be using this for initially is to come up with some ideas. So this is almost like having a little assistant because obviously I work for myself, I'm a solo entrepreneur. I don't have a team that I can bounce ideas off. If you've got this kind of AI technology, we can use it like a team member and ask it for some ideas and ask it what it thinks about things. It's really, really valuable. Um, so the first thing I'm gonna do is ask it for some faceless YouTube video ideas. So I'm just gonna ask it, give me a list of 50 faceless channel ideas that only require voice. So it's given me a list of 50 faceless YouTube channel ideas that only require voice. And there's some really good ideas here. I really like the storytelling niche because we could potentially get ChatGPT, which is very good at writing stories, to write a story. And then we can maybe get some kind of AI voiceover to create it. So that's a really good one. ASMR, that's also a good niche. I know that's very, very big because my girlfriend always listens to that. And it's when people are making noises and telling stories and going, whispering things like that that also could be a good one if we can get a right voiceover for that poetry as well because chat gpt is really good at doing poetry that could potentially work so there's some really good ideas there i think i'm leaning more towards the storytelling angle because that would be very good to create with chat gpt and we could do a voiceover and it could, we could i think that could be really really good but what i'm going to do now is go over to vidiq's keyword research tool where we can actually see if there's any opportunities because i think when you're first starting a brand new youtube channel we really want to be going after search traffic when people search for something. So we want to find a keyword that we can add into our title that probably gets a lot of search volume, but there's not that much competition and we might be able to rank for it. I think that's the best way of being seen on YouTube at the start rather than trying to go viral. So we can just put here like story and then click search. And then what it does, it will give us a, a score based on the search volume and the competition. Now, this is giving us a medium score, which isn't too bad. But what we can do is look at related keywords here. We can click on view all keywords and then we can see some other associated keywords that people might be searching for that we maybe could create a video about. So you can actually come here and change this score here overall. And we want a high score, green is what we're looking for. Now that's Arabic, I think, so I'm not gonna go for that one. Horror stories, that potentially could work. Um, it's got medium competition. And now I'm just gonna kind of search some different things like maybe sleep story and see what that comes back with. 
Again, scary stories there, gets a lot of search volume, but the competition is medium. It still might be quite hard to break through with like medium competition with a brand new YouTube channel. I wanna try and go for something that probably has less search terms, but it's got a very low competition. So this here, romantic love sleep story might work quite well. Romantic sleep stories again. That could be 5,000 views that we're getting on our video, which could help our channel out right at the start. So that is a good opportunity. So romantic love sleep story is some good keywords. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna focus on the, the sleep story niche and I'm gonna try and create a video which is a romantic love sleep story just using AI technology. So what I'm gonna do is head over to ChatGPT, the AI chatbot, and I'm gonna ask it to write me a romantic love sleep story that we could use for our YouTube video. Okay, maybe not. ChatGPT is at capacity right now. Oh, probably should stop doing videos about it because every time I go on it, it's overloaded with people. I'm going to go make myself a cup of coffee, come back, and hopefully we'll be back in action. Boom, and we're back in business. Chat GPT is working. So what I'm going to do is ask it to write me a romantic love story. So I've just asked it, can you write me a thousand word romantic love sleep story that's descriptive? Because I want it to use like really descriptive, elegant words, which will make it a bit more interesting for the people that are listening to it. Once upon a time in a land far, far away, there lived a beautiful princess named Rose. Right, I'm going to stop that it feels a little bit tag it towards children i'm gonna even though i said romantic i'm just gonna change that again and i'm just gonna say can you write a romantic love story that's just, and aimed at adults might be a bit more racy then <laughs> as the sun set on the horizon jane and michael see that's a lot more target towards adults Found them lying in the bed next to each other, their bodies intertwined in a passionate embrace. Ooh. <laughs> Hopefully this is the niche. When they were searching for romantic love stories, I'm guessing this is what they they want as they go to sleep, hopefully anyway. So I've just asked it to, to make it longer and also write some paragraphs about them falling asleep because I want to kind of describe the process of falling asleep, which hopefully should help the people fall asleep. And if someone listening to this romantic love sleep story on YouTube and it helps them fall asleep, they're going to come back to this every night. So it will actually increase the views and they might recommend it to their friends. So we actually want this to, to help people sleep while also being a romantic sleep story. So it's adding some paragraphs about that, which is awesome. So I've got my story written out now and I think it's really, really good story. I think this could work really well. Now I need a voiceover to read this out. Now traditionally, text to voice that we've had for quite a few years is not very good. It's very robotic, but now because of AI technology, it's getting a lot more advanced. And I actually found a tool before called Resemble.ai and I'll leave links to all of these tools in the description down below but they've got some really, really realistic sounding voices. And you can actually clone your voice using this software as well, but they've got lots of stock voices as well. And they've got this one here. In my mind, whispering. there's no better setting for a scary story than summer camp. This one though is different than the ones we remember as kids. So that might work quite well. And they've got like storytelling voices, like this one Merlin. This planet has the power of life. Hey, I'm Richard. Even though I sound a bit grumpy, I'm really a very nice guy. But I, <laughs> I don't think he's going to be good for a, a sleep story. So I think I might actually use this whispering girl because it's a sleep story. It's going to help people sleep. And it also plays into the ASMR niche, which is people whispering. So this could work quite well. I might be able to do some ASMR videos on my channel using this, this, this voice. So I'm just going to come over to here to create, paste my story in here, and I think we click create all, and then it's going to whisper this story out in this girl's voice. It's got some really cool settings here as well, where you can change the emphasis on certain words and, and all of that kind of really cool stuff. But I'm just gonna leave the AI to get to work and see what it produces. As the sun set on the horizon, Jane and Michael found themselves lying in bed next to each other, their bodies entwined in a passionate embrace. The room was dimly lit by the glow of candles, casting oh. a warm and intimate ambience. Oh, I'm falling asleep. So while that's processing those files and downloading, now I think we need a good backing track that's going to be behind her as she's telling this sleep story. And I actually found before some AI music generator. Now we could just use stock music in this, which I think would work quite well. But this is actually a really cool tool as well, where um, I'm actually going to use this on my main channel for, from now because you can create music from scratch and you can actually change the track. So sometimes if you're ever doing video editing and you're adding a music track underneath, if you want it to kind of be gentle, 
all the way through or, or background music, sometimes it'll start going crazy and it'll start being really loud in certain areas and it's not how you want it to be. This AI tool actually allows us to, to create music from scratch. We can choose certain niches like say sentimental down here. Um, and then it will give us some bass tracks, but you can actually edit them and change the melody and change certain parts of the song. And it's really cool. So let's just have a little play at some of these. So in that example there, the music starts as going louder here, but we can just change that to low. So we can actually have it as a really gentle track. So if I like that, or maybe the story changes, it gets a bit, bit raunchy or something, we might want to increase that to very high at that section. But I think for this, I'm just going to go for low throughout because we want them to actually fall asleep. So now I've got an AI generated idea. I've got a story written by AI. We've got a music track created by AI. Now I need to kind of put this all together into a video. Now there is actually some AI video creation tools like this one here called Pictory, which I will leave a link to in the description down below. It is a really cool tool because we basically can upload a script and it can create you a video from scratch using stock images based on what is being said in that video. And it can add text onto the screen. It's actually very, very good and I was planning on using that in this video if I would have gone for a different idea. But for a sleep story, I don't think I need to use that because I've just had a look on YouTube and a lot of these sleep stories are just like a still image with the audio track underneath because people are not really watching the video. They're just listening to it as they fall to sleep. So I don't think I need to create one like that with loads of flashy images and things like that. I'm still going to use AI technology to create a background image for this video. And the tool that I'm going to use for that is this one here called Mid Journey, which I have spoken about on my channel before, but it's an unbelievable AI image creation tool that creates magical images from scratch using AI. And to use this, you just need to click join beta here and and then you get access to a Discord group like this where we can actually send it a message and ask it to create images from scratch. I'll show you how it works now. So all I need to do is just message this mid-journey bot and go forward slash imagine prompt and then just type in whatever image I want it to create. So I'm just going to type in romantic love story. And then I'm going to put in dash dash AR, which stands for aspect ratio, three colon two, which will give us a landscape image and then just click enter and see what it comes back with for that. So mid journey has come back with a few images and I've selected this one, which I think is epic and it perfectly sums up this sleep story. So that's what I'm going to use. Now I need to put all of these files together. So I'm just going to use this program here called Final Cut Pro, which is an editing software, which I've already got on my computer. There's lots of different editing softwares out there that you can use if you're not going to go down the pictory route and get the AI technology to actually compile it for you. So now I just need to put them onto a timeline here and then export this as a video. So I've just overlaid them onto this timeline. I've just played it and I think this is pretty epic. It looks amazing and sounds amazing. I will show you a little bit later on in this video. Now we have the video, but we're not done yet because there's another piece of AI technology that we're going to use to help us get clicks on our video. I've just created a YouTube channel and now it's asking me to create a name. So I'm actually going to go back to vidIQ's AI coach and see whether it can give me a good name for our channel. So here's what it's given us. Soothing sleep tales, sleepy dreams, napping narratives, bedtime enchantment, dreamland journeys. We'll go with that. Sleepy dreams, sleep stories, I'm going to call it. Sleepy dreams, sleep stories, create channel. Then we just need to upload the video. So while the video is uploading, now we need a title for the video. So we can actually use AI to generate as a high click through title that people are going to want to actually click on. So we can come back here to vidIQ and our keyword that we were going for before was romantic love sleep story. Now, obviously that's not high click through title. That's what people are searching for, but we can actually come back to vidIQ's dashboard and they've got another AI tool. This one here called AI title recommendations. So what we can do is paste in our, our keyword that we actually want to rank for. Then we can click get title ideas and it actually uses AI to find the most high click through rate title ideas for that keyword or similar keywords. So it's given us a few here, the most romantic sleep story ever. I mean, that would get people to click how to sleep like a romantic, romantic sleep love story, how one night changed everything. So I'm actually going to take one of these, but I'm going to change it up a little bit just to, to make it a little bit better. So we'll go for the most romantic sleep story ever, but then I'm going to put hyphen and put fall asleep within seconds. So hopefully people that are struggling to sleep that they want a romantic sleep story might click on this even more. Then we can take that title and we can get AI to create as a description for the video as well by going back to this tool, going back to the AI coach 
and saying, write me a description for a video about, and then we'll paste that in there. And now we've got an AI generated YouTube video description. This is crazy. So I've just used the thumbnail, which is the image we got from Mid Journey. We've got it all ready to go. And it's not made for kids. Next, next. And let's set this publish. And we are live. Love themselves lying in bed next to each other, their bodies in mind in a passionate embrace. Wow, I actually think that's actually very good considering we've just created that using total AI technology. I've not thought of any of the ideas. I've not written the script. I've not done the voiceover. I've not done the image. It's all been done with AI technology. And I think that will give any sleep story on YouTube a run for its money. And we're going after keywords that people are actually looking for. And there's not that much competition. So this could do well. So in order to start making money from this YouTube channel, from ad revenue, I will need at least 4,000 hours of watch time to be accepted into the YouTube partner program. So what I'm going to do is actually start uploading a lot more videos to this channel to get to that so I can start earning money. And I will upload part two to this challenge very, very soon. But in the meantime, if you want to know a secret strategy of how you can start earning money from YouTube on day one without having four hours of watch time, make sure you check out this video that I recorded not long ago. It is epic and you do not want to miss it. But if you're not subscribed, make sure you hit subscribe. Until next time, cheers guys.